sure she is. Okay. It's Swire Dan Shield time. Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome back. Today we're going to crack into another booster box. A Sword and Shield. I have taken three packs out. One, two, three. Three packs out of here for a pack battle. But um, we'll go through... Let's say we'll do five packs each. So there's your five. And here's my five. All right. For those of you that are new to the channel, if this is your first time here, thank you so much for joining us. My name is Blizzard Canto, and I post Pokemon pack openings three or more times a week. If you are a fan of the TCG Online, if you like code cards, if you play the game, and you want to get code cards, I would highly recommend hitting the subscribe button and ringing that bell so you're notified when I make videos so you can be one of the first ones here to get the code cards because they go pretty fast. My wife does not give away her code cards, but we're not gonna hate on her for that. They are hers just as much as they are mine. It is my money spent on them just as much as it is hers. She can do with them as she pleases. And she is very, very into the game. She loves to play, so. Swap, no pull for the first pack. So she can do with them as she pleases. But first pack, nothing for me. Then we've got four more. Let's see what Nikki's got in her pack. Palpat, Kingler, Rhydon, Snoms, Brookman, Shelder, Mawile, Galarian Ponyta, Reverse Hollow, Aurora Energy, and a Cloister. Awesome. All right, so far we've got two duds. I'm gonna show the code cards towards the end because of what I don't wanna do is give away the pulls and you can tell in two different ways. I'm gonna show the top part of the code card so you guys can see. See how this part says redeem? This means it's a green code card. If it says TCGO, it means it's a white code card. That's how you can tell the difference. And that's why I'm gonna wait till the end from now on to show them. Because I don't want the polls to be spoiled You're fine. for anyone. She spoils her own polls because she looks at the cards before she gives them to me to show to you guys. I don't spoil my own polls. <laughs> that is my poll. I like to see that. All right. Pack number two for me. <clears throat> Hope you all had a wonderful President's Day off. It is now the weekend, so I know those short weeks always somehow seem longer. Um, but I hope everyone had a good long weekend and maybe have another one coming up there soon. Womp, womp, womp. Um, but yeah, if you guys had anything exciting over the long weekend, the last weekend, let me know what you did. If you've been getting some super spicy pulls from Sword and Shield, let me know what you've been getting. We've been getting some pretty good pulls online. Um, a friend of mine traded some of their codes to me for some Hidden Fate Shinies they were missing. And I pulled not only a Hyper Rare Marnie on the online game, but I also pulled a Hyper Rare Ordinary Rod, which was amazing. Dang! Hot garbage today, guys. What's going on? Which is depressing. I'm trying to look at them before. But I, I can't know you see are, it. but your face gives it away sometimes, so I don't like when you do that. <laughs> and then you'll start getting a sleeve out, and that tells me. I didn't get any sleeves this time. No, not this time, because probably because we're not going to pull anything. That's okay, though. Half the fun? Hey, a hollow Cinderace. Hey, half, the, half the fun is just opening the cards and seeing what you get. And especially, I think now we both have um, a better appreciation for the cards, even when we don't get the ultra rare and the hyper rare pulls, because some of the trainers, some of the regular cards are incredibly useful, like Air Balloon, one of my favorite trainers, uh, are incredibly useful in the actual trading card game, which we just learned how to play recently because we wanted to atten attend a Sword and Shield pre-release. So we had to make sure we could play the game. So we didn't make fools of ourselves. And it was absolutely amazing. And now we're both addicted to the game. Yeah. Can't help it. True story. All right. So if you also play the TCG online, you can send me a friend request at my name. Oh, you distracted me because you touched my leg and I love you so much. <laughs> <I'm> sorry. <laughs> the littlest thing. It's just like, <laughs> pet me. <laughs> um, all she did was like that. <laughs> and I'm like, mm, broken. <sighs> Uh, da -da. If you would like to play the trading card game online with me, you can add me at Wizard of Canto, capital W, capital K, not a capital O, 
Uh, but yeah, you'll probably win. Just saying. I'm not very good at building decks. Uh, my decks aren't very consistent. <gasps> oh, hey, Hyper Rare Professor's Research! Yeah. Let's go! Oh, look at you! Look She's at been wanting this card, if you couldn't tell. <gasps> oh, I was talking to my one of my friends on Instagram. And she couldn't remember the professor's name. And she was like, that old bitch. The old, old rainbow bitch. I was like, oh my god. It had me dying. Holy crap, look at that, guys. I think you got the good side this time. I must have. Starting off strong with the rainbow. Um, down below, I will always put the price. Pricing is accurate uh, as of the day of recording, which is today, February 20th. So... All of the prices from my videos, you all, I've been getting questions about where I get my pricing information. I don't always take market value because sometimes the mid-range asking price and the mid-range selling price on eBay is significantly higher because of, you know, supply and demand and everything. And I want to give you guys the most accurate information possible, especially if you're trying to sell your cards. I don't want to show you guys a price and then you sell your card and find out that the market price is undervaluing what you have. So that's why I use mid-range. Hey, a hollow rail. Oh, fuck. Yes, yeah, sorry. Oh, math. Oh, stop. This is the Rillaboom that I need for my deck. Because of this ability, there are two Rillabooms, numbers 14 and 15. This one, that's the one I needed. I'm so excited. Do we have this one? Okay. Huh. All right, I'm going to do your last pack first because we've been doing your last pack last. I often. have been yawning this entire video. <laughs> Nikki had the day off today, which is very strange. She usually doesn't have days off, um, other than the weekend. She is a general contractor, so she works very long hours, and when she sits at home and does really not much throughout the day, she is absolutely exhausted <laughs> because she's used to moving around a lot, and when you finally sit down, you get tired. <gasps> a Cramorant V! Look at him! Don't I we have this? Uh, I know we have the full art because I pulled it twice. Oh, so I don't think we do have this. I, Ooh, now I'm on the cat. Here, right here, baby. Um, Kramer and V, if you guys do play the TCG or if you're just getting into it, this is a very good card to have. His first move, Beat Catch, allows you, only costs one energy, and it allows you to go into your deck and pull out any two cards. Does not have to be a Pokemon, doesn't have to be a trainer, doesn't have to be basic. You don't have to show your opponent either. And with a retreat cost of one... He is a must-have in any deck. He's good for the Zossie and ADP decks. He's good for basically anything. Because he's normal, he can take any energy. And then Spit Shot is um, his actual attack that does damage. And it does 160 damage, which is a heck of a lot. We're a little uh, slow here sometimes. Slow on the uptake. Alrighty. And flip this over. We've got a Water Energy. Rare yep. Candy. Lumberry. Corvusquire, Joltic, Silly Cobra, Flitbug, Goldeen, Yamper, Reverse Hollow Anaconda, and a Mudsdale. One. We can't end it like that, babe. We gotta do one more pack each. Take that from my Last, side. I took yours from your side, yeah. Last pack magic. And then I promise you guys I will show you the code cards. One, one ultra rare or above pull is not bad when it's a rainbow rare. Oh, oh no, sorry. We did get two. I keep forgetting because you took the Cramorant away. Mm -hmm. It oh. confuses me. <laughs> he went in his spot. You didn't he, have him. He went in his spot. So I will show you guys the binder too after this. Gosh, we are all over the place today. B, this is another very useful trainer card. It allows you to attach more than one energy in a turn. Once you have attached your energy to your active Pokemon or whoever you're attaching energy to, you can play B, your supporter card, and, ha and, and attach an energy to one of your benched Pokemon. Educational Kanto. Just kidding. You guys probably already knew that. Reverse Hollow Grookman. And a Hollow Oranguru, which we needed, I think. Uh, maybe. I'm, pre I'm pretty sure if he's the one right after Dub Wool, 148. Nope. <gasps> he goes here. Yep. <gasps> we needed him! I use him in my online deck because of his ability, Primate Wisdom, allows you to <coughs> put one of your cards on the top of your deck and then you take the top the card the top card from your deck and put it in your hand just like a easy way to get to draw a card during your turn so not bad at all all right we'll put these up here we put our reverse hollow here and then we got baby's last pack Garbage. quick ball mantine dotler jinjo krabby 
Mangino, Galarian Ponyta, Cottony, Reverse Hollow Mudsdale, and a Drapion. All right, well, so we got two hyper rare pull, one ultra rare, one hyper rare pull. You want it back? Two mm -hmm. hollows. No, baby, I don't need to have it back. But the prices will be listed below when they are pulled, and I will have the total right down here just about now. Let me get these code cards for you guys. Please make sure that you're not taking all the code cards at once. Take one, pass it along. You know, don't take them all for yourself. Sharing is caring. I'm going to take this. <laughs> I'm just going to take this. We want everyone to have a chance to get some of these codes. So don't be greedy. Be kind to your fellow Pokemon community members. And like I said, you guys are more than welcome to add me on Pokemon TCG Online. Um, I'm not very good at the game, so please don't laugh at me. But I do try really hard, and I think it's really fun. All right, we're going to start off the binder review. I know it's a little bit late. Let's see. We're going to go through and see if we can put any of our reverse hollows away. It doesn't look like we have any other grass types besides this Grookey here, which we already have. Then we'll go ahead over to the electric types. Flippy, flippy, flippy. And this kind of shows you guys just how much we do have done. It's absolutely insane. We already have that Joltik. Um, how fast we've been getting through this set. I already have the Chin Chow. Let's see about the Santa Conda Silly Cobra and the Mudsdale. Da 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 da. We did not have the Reverse Hollow Santa Conda, so I'm going to slip him right here in his spot. We did have the Mudsdale and the Silicobra. Now we're looking at Scorpion and Krogunk. We got the Scorpion and the Krogunk Reverse Hollows already. Alright, to the Trainer section and Energy section, we've got Energy Search, Potion, and Aurora Energy. Energy Search, check. Potion, check. Aurora Energy, check. Now. For the moment of truth, time to put away our lovely professor, card number 209. She's going to go right here. I'm going to scoot this over so you guys can actually see her be put away. Right here in slot 209, next to the Team Yelgrunt. So, to give you guys a little bit of a better view here, we are missing Full Arts. This is where the Full Arts start, right after the trainer, so we are missing quite a few of those. This is all Full Arts, and this page will be all Secret Rares. This is the dupes that we've pulled, and then behind that is our Japanese set. We're missing a couple Reverse Hollows. Let's count the trainers that we're missing. Reverse Hollow forms them. Um, I don't think we have the Reverse Hollow. I think we just have non hollow Okay, so yep, that's one, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're missing eight reverse holo trainers, which is not many, honestly. We're not missing any trainers, actually. And the only cards that we're missing here is the Full Art Stone Journer V, the second Sandaconda. The it's just a regular rare, it's not a V or anything. Then. The Morpico VMAX. Da, 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 da. The Torkoal Full. Wait a minute. We do have a Torkoal full, full Art. Um, or no, I'm sorry, that's supposed to be VMAX, isn't it? Yeah, because Full Art's back here. Okay, second so guessing myself now, guys. We gotta go check. Torkoal 108, or 188, yes. Okay, so we're missing the VMAX. It will not be a Full Art, I don't think. And then, the first card of the set, which is, I would assume, Celebi B? Yes. Because we don't have Celebi yet. I don't think. I have it in the online game, and I absolutely love it. It's got a fantastic move set, and it's just great overall. But, sorry, that was a long time coming. I kept meaning to, to post it, and then I ended the recording and am putting this in after, so. Huh, what a week, you guys. I hope you guys are having a fantastic weekend. I hope you get some rest and relaxation. Um, but yeah, 
I hope you guys liked this video, and if you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, subscribe down below. I really appreciate it. And ring the bell for notifications if you want to get code cards because they go super fast. I post new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And in the description below, you will find my social media links for Instagram, Twitter, and Twitch. I stream on Twitch a couple times a week, usually around 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Don't have a set schedule right now, but that's okay. You can always hit me up on Instagram, and I will let you know if I am going to be streaming that evening. And check my story on Instagram, too. I, will, I usually post if I'm going to go live, so... Ah, I breathed that time. Hope you guys have a safe, wonderful weekend. I'll see you next time. You were telling me that I should breathe. She's biting me!